the d- d- dance floor is now open. Hi hey everyone, it's Buddy with TBA Productions. I have another really cool product review, and I had to do a shout out to NFLX uh, Pro. And the reason why is that I I can't believe how fast the product came. Now, I, I've had this for a while. I haven't opened it up because I wanted to do it here. But I wonder, what did I order? Hmm, I guess you have to find out in a second or two. I have my package in front of me right here from NLFX uh, Professionals. And again, you can find them on nlfxpro.com. If you're looking for DJ gear, they're one of the best places to go to on the web. I will tell you that. Uh, they have a lot of great stuff there. And uh, it's, it's someone who, uh, uh, as someone who is a professional DJ and is out, you know, doing weddings, stuff like that, um, I will say that, you know, having this tool in front of me is an important thing to have in your repertoire and to have in your uh, equipment. And the reason why, you guys will see in a minute or so when I open the box up. All right, I'm here in my office and you have a look right here at my table. You have my keyboard here, my beat up mouse. And, uh, oh, yeah, I have here uh, a stereo legs. This one right here, uh, unfortunately, is uh, not 100% for some reason or another. And this is something that uh, I don't know if I could fix or I ordered or already got a new one. But uh, I got to see what I could do with this one. Hopefully, I can fix it. Um, so you can see right here, NFLX professionals you know this is nfx all pro, uh, pro and nlfx pro i like for, like as before uh if you are a dj or a s professional sound person uh they have basically everything you need they're more a little more geared toward dj but again if you're looking for sound equipment um definitely recommend it anyone is in sound dj doesn't matter if you're a beginner uh, media, uh, medium DJ, a big DJ, you're on a DJ company, a uh, big, huge company, multi, you know, op, uh, you have multiple sets, you have multiple rigs out. This is something you should have uh, in your equipment area. And the reason why you should have it uh, as far as equipment wise is a couple of reasons. Uh, first thing first, um, we deal with cabling all the time. We deal with everything all the time. And one of the things that we deal with is the need to uh, check things. And I'm opening this up, as you can see here. I have not opened this package up uh, previously. And the reason I say that is because the fact that this is how nicely it is taped. And you can see very, very, very well done. This was actually on back order for a little bit, uh, a little back order. Um, but this is really cool stuff, and I'm opening this up for the first time with you. And you can see, oh, this is cool stuff right here. Some cool swag right here. You know, nothing, mother of all testers right there. Uh, nothing says, you know, quality of stuff and you believe in the stuff. I think I get an idea what it is. Uh, tester is to have a sticker made of the item that you actually bought. And it is what I got. And... That is awesome right there. And then, of course, our friends right there, NLFX Professionals, NLFX Pro, awesome people to deal with. Definitely would say, you know, to talk to them. Uh, Signwinder. Uh, there's, I believe they're cables, if I remember correctly. Uh, I got I to gotta buy some cables. I'm going to try and buy some cables. I'm not going to try and buy I'm going to buy some cables from NFX Pro. Uh, I know they make some custom stuff. Um, they again look for theirs awesome. So if you're looking for stuff, give them a call, give them a reach out, a shout out on social media and so forth, so on. And uh they also I they I think they do have a channel here on YouTube. Rumor has it. <laughs> so out of the box here, and you can see that was the only thing in the box. Just a little bit of bubble wrap to protect it. 
But again, perfect fit box, you know, tape perfectly, professionally done. I mean, you know, the Uline box, um, very, very well done. And this is, again, this is something I have a tester, but it's an older tester and it's not as nice as this and it doesn't have as much as this. Um, I mean, you have basically everything HDMI on this. So again, if you're someone who is doing pro audio installs and you do an HDMI cables, this has HDMI tester on it. So you could take, you could take an HDMI, HDMI cable and test it and make sure it's, is it a cable or is it something else? And this is so simple. You know, electricians have fluke meters and other meters to check, uh, uh, power to things and if something's wrong they can track down on a wire wh where something's wrong at or replace the wire um electricians do that all the time you know and i'm not an electrician uh i can't say uh that you know that i know that by example but i've known that from talking to electricians that and again i've had electrical work here and had you know electricians out here repairing stuff and then tracking down a short somewhere um so this is one of the things that can and will make your Maya ease, especially with checking out this stuff. And I'm opening this up right now. And wow, this is nice. Look, look at this. Look at this. Okay, so the box, nothing else in the box. I'm gonna put this box off to the side. Look how look how nice that is, folks. Look at that. That is so nice. I mean, you guys at NFLX, you know, this is this is like this is awesome. This is absolutely, absolutely awesome. And you can see my <laughs> I got some of my pants right there. <laughs> um, this is absolutely awesome. And All right, so open it up, have the owner's manual, which number one thing you should always do, read your owner's manual. Folks, it's there for a reason. Even it has a warning and dangers on it. You don't want to be hurt. It has a little pocket here. And in this pocket, we have, look at that, testers. Wow. This makes me feel like an electrician or somebody that works on electrical uh, equipment or someone who works on electronics. But um, and my father-in-law, who was a uh, electrician for the electric company here in the Chicagoland area, uh, when he passed, uh, I, I I got a lot of his uh, took a lot of his stuff. I don't know what to do with all of it, but I do know some basics. And one of the things is a flute meter, and with his flute meter, uh, they have a similar um, you know, testers is this, so you could actually put black for ground, red for hot, and check. You know, you could check continuity. You could check a lot of things with, with this. This is this is absolutely awesome that this is in here. This is you know, again, I wouldn't check you know, uh, one ten outlets with this. I wouldn't check that kind of stuff. But for you know, checking cabling, um, that's not a bad thing. Oh, this thing is this got a little weight to it. You know. The other one I have, um, and I'm not trying to knock it, uh, but from Behringer, and it, it worked really well, um, and it still works. I just uh, lost a little cover on the <laughs> on the back for the battery, and uh, I'm like, you know what? I've had it for a few years. I, I should get a much better one, which is this, and it has much more capability of testing. And again, I'm just taking off everything here. Plastic bag. I mean, you know, again, it's it's packaged very, very well. And I'm going to put this over here. I'm going to put the bag right over here and the owner's manual right here. And just, you can see right here, this is, you know, uh, you have for quarter uh looks like for quarter inch yeah quarter inch 
Um, RCA. Look at you can check RCA plugs on this. You know, we have RCA plugs going from, you know, if you have controllers with CDJs or even RCAs going to something else, uh, some of the uh, basic controllers, uh, you know, you do RCA out to an actual mixer. Uh, you can check your RCAs and make sure because you have your, uh, your each side you plug into on each side of the unit. Um, XLR, you have, uh, let's see here. XLR five pin. Uh, you got uh, see here. Uh, I got upside. I got upside down to me, so I got to look what it has. So I'm gonna do on this side, <laughs> so I can read what it says. So you have quarter inch RCA, DIN. So that is you know your digital, your five pin XLR, your three pin XLR. So you could. Uh, I, I have to double check. But you should be able to test your uh, cabling also to do DMX, your DMX cable, because DMX can be 5-pin or 3-pin. It's just, you know, DMX cables do run digital. They don't run audio signals, so I always want to keep them separate. Make sure you know your, what your DMX, what your uh, um, XLR. But I would have to double-check, and again, I'm, I'm just saying is do not do it until you double-check and triple-check yourself because I do not want your cable shorted out or any problems. But still, XLR, 5-pin, 3-pin, I, I, I don't know if it does DMX, but if it does, it is actually cool. You have your uh, speak-on cable, power-con cable. And again, it's reverse on the other side. So you basically plug in one into the other side, and you loop it around. So you grab it for two ends. You have your USB-B cable. To USB A cable, so you can check your USB, uh, your USB cable. You can check your USB A cable. You can check your RJ forty five cable, which is your Ethernet cable, three point five millimeter, you know, plug. That right there, you know, is, is basically headphone jack to headphone jack, and those are, you know, I have a couple sets here that I could plug into. Easy, simple as that. And, you know, you have here uh, one quarter TRS to one quarter TRS. You have HDMI, HDMI. You have, you know, up here, micro SD, USB-C, USB-C. So you have USB-C to USB-C, or no, USB micro, I'm sorry. USB micro, USB, micro USB. No USB-C. I was hoping it was USB-C, but it's not. Um, maybe the next generation will put USB-C in. Uh, it gives you an example to upgrade. So micro USB to micro USB. You have, you know, a lot of your connecting cables here, and you're basically switching between everything here, you have battery check, you have your, your connector for your two leads, which I just showed here. So you can connect your two leads in. Black goes to black, your ground, red goes to red, your positive, and boom, there's your leads. I mean, this right here, other than USB-C, it has a lot of things covered. And I didn't put a battery in here. As you see, I've not done it yet. Um, I will be putting a battery on afterwards. Um, there is warnings on the outside because, you know, again, you're dealing with electrical items. There is warnings for risk of danger, uh, for warnings. Uh, make sure you follow all the warnings, all the procedures. There's... Um, Read the owner's manual. There's no, um, <laughs> there's no second chance on uh, on getting hurt, and you don't want to get hurt in any way, shape, or form. So read the owner's manual, um, and then that's on any item. You always want to read the owner's manual because there's a lot of information on there. Maintenance, what you need. It looks like. For battery-wise, looks probably like a 9-volt. 
battery, left tip for a battery. So you need to pop that. Which do I have? I always have a little tool set not far away. And yep, nine volt battery goes in there. So I'll be putting a nine volt battery in here and using that. And I, again, I just can't say how awesome this is of a system. You know, you have 99% of the connectors you use as a professional DJ. HDMI, um, that right there, you know, if you're doing video uh, and you're not getting video, that, that right there is awesome right there, HDMI. If you're doing, you know, again, USB-B, USB-A. So if you're doing, you know, a DJ set, um, and you're connecting your uh, your mixer to your controller, or you control uh, your controlling you're connecting your um, controller to your computer. Your USB A to USB B. Now I I know eventually to go USB C. Uh, a lot of the manufacturers I guess are talking about it, or it's going to become a standard. So you'll see less and less USB B and USB A on controllers and it'll go be USB C because it's become the standard like it is on on cell phones on uh and tablets but it's still even if you have this for a while and you get and then have another generation USB C this is still good because there's going to be USB B and A for around for quite a while HDMI again this is that's is awesome uh you know small uh small din again that right there again is awesome. Uh, it is just an awesome, awesome unit. It is, if you could feel this, this is all metal here. This is well built. This is nice. And they give you a chart in the back to go through stuff. And they also give you some uh, again, additional information here right on the back of the unit. And I will tell you that, you know, this right here from NLFX uh, Pros. This is awesome. This is an awesome unit. I'm glad I got this. Um, I also had to do a shout out to the guys in the chill room, uh, Howie Darkstar, and them um, talking about this and saying, hey, you need to have one a while back. I ordered one. It was on back order for a little bit. And I, I will tell you that uh, uh, they got it out pretty quick, even when it's on back order for a little bit. So even if you order one right now and it's on back order, don't worry about it. They'll get back in quickly, and they are fast. Awesome, awesome people to deal with. I would definitely recommend, and when you get a chance, you talk to NLFX Pros. If you need anything for DJ, sound reinforcement, professional audio, uh, dance lighting, stuff like that, anything you guys kind of need, talk to them. And, it, you know, again, they're, they're great people to talk to. And I can tell you right now that, it is awesome to have this in my hand. It's awesome to have something that um, I can look at and go, wow, this is this is going to help out. This is something I'm going to put into my tool cart, which is uh, what Trace and I call it to as Max. Uh, we have a tool uh, toolbox that we wheel around everywhere. This is going to go in every single gig with me because you never know, on a gig, something happens. It's going to go back in the little bag here and I put the battery in it. And it's going to go with us to every single gig uh, because the fact that you never know when a cable fails you, you can check right there and then. Again, especially, you know, XLR cable, I could plug one in here, boom, boom, and check XLR cable and make sure, is it a bad cable? Is it something else? Is it a bad ground? Whatever it is, I can have tools for it. And this is another tool that should be in your toolbox. So... This is something that uh, I would definitely recommend. So if you like that review, you like that product, and you want to see more of that on the channel as well as everything else I do, the D D uh, Dish Jockey. Um, yeah. Three, two, one. 
If you want to see more products like that reviewed on the channel, as well as the DJ Round Table Show, and as well as gig logs, uh, please hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, give me a thumbs up, tell me down in the comments down below, would something like this help you? And I hope it would, because I, I know it's going to help me. And I think that every single DJ who is out there who is a good DJ, and I know I have a lot of good DJs that watch me, uh, on here as well as watch my my uh, my gig logs and watch the DJ Roundtable show with all the other great DJs I'm with, I'm sure I'm going to talk to them about make sure they get one for themselves and they have one in their toolbox, um, whatever they have. You know, everybody has that one, your bag or box or anything that you want to have this on there. You want to have this in there to have everything ready to go so you want to have the again this tester right here. There's a, a little little string. Oh man, that's it. <laughs> but I will tell you that you need to have this in your toolbox. You need to have this in your tool bag. You need to have this in your cable bag. You need to have this in a bin. You you need to have this in a tote. Whatever you carry your extra stuff with, your extra batteries and so forth and so on. This is something that you want to have, you want to use, and you want to keep close by because when you need to test something, boom, there it is, ready to go. Uh, I can't tell you how important this is and how great of a tool this is to have, and I'm glad I'm adding this to my inventory, and it will be out uh, at the next uh, wedding, which will be in uh, a few weeks for me. Yes. So, and this will be for every wedding they run out. So any place, anytime you do something, uh, wedding show, whatever, this is going to be with us. So this is something important. Other than that, guys, again, like, subscribe, critiques, comments, criticisms, anything else, put it down below down there. Other than that, give a thumbs up, like the channel, follow the channel. And if you want to watch the DJ Roundtable live, make sure you watch DJ Roundtable live on Twitch. It's TBM Productions underscore buddy on Twitch. You can always follow me there. Uh, I do DJ up there as well. I do music videos.